Gordon Hayward returns to the lineup as the Utah Jazz take on the Chicago Bulls. We get started, though, with Derrick Rose going in for the floater, and Chicago goes up 9-4. to four. Then Rose looking and finding his buddy Taj Gibson, who throws that one down, and it's 13-6 Chicago in front. Utah fights back. Raul Neto finds Gordon Hayward open for the three. He had nine points in his return. 25-19, your count. Joe Ingles then with the alley-oop, and Hayward, does he still have the hop? Oh, yeah, he does. He goes right up and stuffs that one home. Gets it up and barely over, but that counts. And Chicago's lead at eight. Nikola Miritich dishing to Derrick Rose, who pulls up for the jumper. He had 16 points in the first half. That's good production out of D. Rose. Into half number two, it's Rose driving for the little reverse layup. Nifty stuff there, and yep, we're gonna show you a replay of that. Chicago up by 11, 56 to 45 at that point. Later in the third quarter, Shelvin Mack finds Derek Favors, and Favors stuffs this one home. He had 24 points and six rebounds on the game in this slow developing play. Still third quarter, Gordon Hayward to Rodney Hood for the open three Hood. Had 14 points on the game, 58 to 52. Chicago, a six point lead after that three pointer goes down. In the fourth quarter, Bobby Portis dishing to Jimmy Butler. Jimmy Butler using the bank, 13 points, five rebounds, six assists for Butler. It's a 14 point advantage. And then to finish this thing off, it's D Rose, 22 points, four assists on the night. Chicago gets the W by seven. Your final score, 92 to 85.